I'm just very excited, can't wait to see what happens, just, just ready to get to it. I believe this is like more intense and more competitive in the summer because, you know, now we got the head coach and everybody here watching, so we got to really get to, to our stuff and do what we got to do. Our uh, expectations are really high, you know. Um, you know, we, we still haven't done nothing as a team together, but as far as excitement for practice, I'm just, as a senior and a leader of this team, you know, being able to, you know, you know, be effective towards talking to the young guys and, and, and leading them towards the right direction. Just be real solid defensively. As far as, you know, last year we had a couple ups and downs towards the defensive, you know, and, and that's our whole engine this year, defensive, and just, uh, you know, just a... Just to relate and just, you know, just to soak it all in, you know, what the coach is talking about. Yeah, it's different because, you know, we were uh, working on our offensive sets throughout the summer and, uh, you know, we're getting familiar with the coach's system and how he wants to run the offense. But, uh, you know, now we do it um, first October, October 12th, we're going to defense, defense, defense. So, you know, we, we ready. We're ready to take on the challenge. I think our expectation every year is to you know, uh, find a way into the NCAA tournament, you know, uh, contend for the conference. You know, that's our expectations here at Utah. So it ain't no different than any other year. You know, I think it's the same way all around the country. Our guys certainly are excited, and uh, coaches, players, everybody, and uh, it's a good day. Uh, the key is, will you be this way in late February? You know, still have that same energy and enthusiasm. You know, we've never tried to sell a team short. Um, we, we feel like we're more talented than we were a year ago. We should be. We were starting from scratch a year ago, and we've added. Um, whether or not it will all transfer into wins, given that we're still the 12th youngest team in the country, going from youngest to 12th youngest, and given the strength of uh, the strongest non-conference schedule in the school's history, uh, whether or not it all translates to wins, I don't know. I know I'm excited about it and seeing who they're going to be and where we're ultimately going to be. And I know that this year is going to serve us really well as we continue to move forward. You've had a real good feel-good, feel-good uh, offseason if you're a player. Not who wouldn't want to be here. They just shot the ball and worked on their skills. and uh, They uh, uh, learned a little offense. You know, all the fun stuff. And uh, now we're going to get down to doing things that are necessary.